Welcome to WGRP Goblin Radio Podcast. everyone i would like to welcome you to the goblin radio podcast today we're going to be recording a DD game i am matt i am a human magus and i'm one of the players um and i'm nick i am i'm i'm your human uh I believe it. What? What? What was it? The butt, Swash, butt, Swash. Butt, swashbuckler. Yeah. You drew you about to say butt swashbuckler. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I may or may not be slightly tired. Um, butt swashbuckler. I am a human butt swashbuckler. <laughs> and it begins. Keep and it, it begins. begins. Yeah, we're gonna. Uh, but yes, I'm a human swashbuckler. Thank you, motherfuckers. <laughs> and um, butt swashbuckler. Yeah, I'm. I'm one of the other players. Uh, I'm Bree. I'm one of the other players too. Who am I? Like, what am I? I'm a. I'm playing a sylph. Sliff. Sliff. Not sylph. not a milf. A sliff. I'm not a milf. <laughs> <laughs> no, you said you're you're the sliff godling. Sliff. It's not spelled like slim. I S L Y P H. Okay. Sliff. Anyways, I'm Kurt. I'm the friendly neighborhood GM. Or, though, <laughs> though later on, these guys won't consider me so friendly. Oh, right Bitch, we already know. <laughs> oh, 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 such loving people. You know it. So nice to me. <laughs> Kurt is the general manager. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, right. get to work. <laughs> All right. All right, so, Kurt, why don't you start us off in the world and where we're... All up right, at? lady and gents. This is the world of ether. Once magic and te- Minecraft. Jesus. Magic and technology once ruled this world ultimately. People would spend their days in relative peace, comfort and happiness until their own hubris got the better of them. An event happened. <laughs> That literally shook the world. Not just shook the world, but tore it to shreds. The earth itself was ripped from the stony bones bones of the planet and thrown skyward. So like Taco Tuesday, right? Taco Tuesday. <laughs> Shit hit the fan. More than one fan. It's all over the place. It's a big old mess. There's a spelling of brown to, everywhere. Yeah. So I talk on Tuesday. <laughs> well, I'm sorry that I make spicy tacos. I'm alone. <clears throat> but that wasn't the what people would consider the end. Because even though this horrendous event occurred, they started to rebuild. Until... More shit hit the fan. Tears in the very fabric of the world allowed creatures, these abominations, to pour forth. This time was known as the bleed, where literally things from other worlds bled into this one. A comet at the height of the bleed appeared in appeared in the sky. Most people assume that this was just going to be another apocalyptic event of something hitting the world. When in truth, this comet helped help seal the breaches. About 1500 years later, we now reach our party. Your boat sl- flies gently on the breeze. 
normal day. Good strong winds at, at your back. The creaking of the ropes. And Crow screeching his ever loving head off that it's dawn. First person to rise, as usual, is dear old Carpenter. Our burly, slightly odd, angry, happy individual. I really don't know how to better <laughs> describe him, so I shall bring that over to Matt, because this is his character. Uh, so, as Carpenter wakes up, he is in a relatively grouchy mood, because at night, he decided to try to start carvings of things that he usually does in his free time. And he goes and tries to start finding food for him, the crew, and to make sure Crow eats something. <laughs> Nick. So your character is almost usually last to rise, but for some reason Crow really pissed you off this morning. Which is usual for Crow. <laughs> Very true. So um um your 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 friendly neighborhood uh Butt Swashler. <laughs> Butt Swashler. <laughs> yes. <thank you. laughs> um, Ajax gets up. That, that that's me. That's um, me. Ajax gets up and uh, just kind of wa- stumbles around trying to get his footing after a. I can. I, I think most people would say a heavy night's drink, but um. For him, it's Tuesday. It was, it's it's more like his nightcap. <laughs> Tuesday. Yeah. Um. Just trying to orient himself and figure out where he is, and then after that, he remembered. That he was on his ship, and then he remembers that damn bastard up in the fucking nest, not shutting his goddamn fucking beak or whatever the hell he's got. Really? The alcohol really got to me last really? night. <laughs> really got to. Him. But um, yeah, and just start stumbling out into the sunlight, and then instantly regrets it. <laughs> Son, ah. Uh, you hear as you see the crow just keeps going, It's daylight, it's daylight, it's daylight, it's daylight! Shut the bloody fuck up. <laughs> why? Because you're an annoying asshole, that's why. You're the one who drinks too much? Bitch, that was nightcap. <laughs> you should see me on Tuesday. <laughs> but it is Tuesday. <laughs> Come to the bar tonight! <laughs> if you can get out your goddamn nest, you fucking... Pigeon ass bitch. <laughs> Crow just screeches at you, just <laughs> buries himself back, back, back in his makeshift. Cro- well, crow's nest. I would call it the crow's nest of the ship because well, it's crow's nest. <laughs> Bumps. <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> anyway, but the unusually last to rise amongst our our little group is. Bree's character. <laughs> yeah, yeah, your character is finally starting to go. <gasps> Until morning. Yes. What are you doing? What am I doing? Yeah. What are you? The character me. wakes up. Yes. Yeah. Here's Crow going fucking nuts as always. <laughs> Some slightly slurred bastard yelling right back. I'm just gonna wander around the cabin, see who else is up. See who else is up. Well, the only other doors that are open are Carpenter's and Ajax's doors. Captain has his own cabin up mm-hmm. top. Of course, first mate's like right next door to him. Mm-hmm. The other, the other three crew members, they're still gone. They're they're knocked out. Yeah. So, do you go up on deck? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's see what's a brewing. Well, you definitely hear the brouhaha that is Ajax and Crow screeching at each other. As you, as you walk up the stairs, of course, you're going, oh, that's usual. Mm-hmm. That, that, that's Crow, that's Ajax. Though Ajax sounds oddly sober. <laughs> Soberer than usual. Sounds uh, like we need to make so, a supply run. <laughs> <laughs> so by now, Carpenter would have went to like the mess hall, talked to the cook, and 
get ship doesn't really have a mess hall. Well, we, we have, have a room with a table and chairs. Yeah. <laughs> but, so um, so I but by then he he's already got that heard the kerf- kerfuffle of Crow <laughs> and Ajax and just he grabs like he grabs like some bird seed for Crow and he grabs um just a hunk of like meat like just uh, like a like turkey salted leg. pork yeah sort of, sort of and, shit. like he grabs one for him and grabs one for Indus- a- ajax and like as he's walking out he just throws it at ajax eat hush <laughs> it's too early and he starts climbing up crow's next and to give make sure crow gets his breakfast in the distance below him he just hears a soft ow <laughs> <laughs> oh and well yeah as you get up as you get up to crow's crow's nest you see your your halfling sitting there in the middle of this cacophony of wood shavings twigs feathers cloth anything and everything that you can possibly think of he scavenged from well the crew <laughs> the ship Rope, hair, leather, Ajax left boot string that he's been looking for for the past three days. Of course, he's wearing his his, his usual. <laughs> he's he's wearing his usual black uh, black outfit with the random just feathers just stuck in his sleeves, shirt, coat, and his cape. <laughs> Or just, just just woven together crow feathers. Oh my god. Though he's oddly not wearing his helmet. Which is <laughs> odd which is weird because the captain glued it to his head last week. <laughs> hey hey crow, buddy. What? Here's here's your breakfast. Hmm. Seed. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Um, start start shoveling it in. I got a question for you, uh, what? buddy. What? Where, where's your helmet? You like to know. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> well, it took me a week to fucking get the glue out of my hair, and I finally got it off. It ain't going back on. Well, that's for your protection. <laughs> <laughs> what protection? My bird. <laughs> How, uh, why does everybody assume every time I go for a fly that I'm going to hit my head on something? <laughs> every time! Just because sometimes birds, birds, they just don't always take off the first time. From I'm the, not a hatchling anymore. I, I know you're not. He can't fucking fly. <laughs> I know, buddy. I, I know. I know you're not. And we had a clip we, last week. <laughs> I, My ass still hurts. Good. <laughs> hey, don't don't pay attention to the drunk. <laughs> It, it, it's okay. We we just want that on you just in case if for some reason when you try to take <laughs> off your, your wings just aren't strong enough. Just in case cuz everyone gets tired every once in a while. Hashtag I've been carpenter. chained in this nest for a month. <laughs> I know you get out. <laughs> I'm in my bird so you've been alone. <laughs> if you don't if you just put the helmet on, I'll make sure the captain doesn't know you get out. Crow digs through a pile of twigs he had over on the side, takes out his helmet. It's got the typical straps and whatnot that a usual sort of flight helmet would have, along with that giant fucking crow skull <laughs> on top Wait, of it. What? Yeah, oh. crow skull. Like plague doctor thing? No, literal bone. <laughs> Puts it. He puts puts back back into the head and gives you a rather rude gesture and fucking starts eating his bird seed. Thank you, buddy. Uh, I just want to make sure you're safe. That's all I care about. I'll make sure you. I bring up some corn for lunch. Corn. Cracked. We'll talk. <laughs> and I start going back to All right. As you leave Crow to his unusual devices, you see. Your sliff companion walk up out of the hey. onto the deck. Hey. Hi. Hi, small one. Hey. <laughs> I'm sure that's not what button sounds like. Hey. Hey. 
Oh. Yeah. Pressure's on the button. Oh, no. <laughs> Jack's just asleep on the... Okay. Real quick, Mr. GM DM, slide into the GM's... General manager. Um, general ma- oh, dungeon manager. Um... <laughs> Are we talking like standard looking pirate ship with the big pointy thing at the front? Well, no shit, Jen. Good shit! Okay. Basically, your ship is a typical. <laughs> is a typical pirate galleon, or what you would consider a pirate galleon. But instead of the mast and sail and all that good shenanigans, it's a fucking balloon! Bling, bling, yeah. bling. That has been, that has been, that has been patched to hell, but of course, the captain's cheaper than fuck, so he only repairs shit when he absolutely has to, and Carpenter can only keep it, can only keep her afloat for so fucking long before all of a sudden the random bullet goes, and there goes the ship again, which was last Wednesday. Hey, listen. What day is? Tuesday. <laughs> we have gone six days without an incident. <laughs> um, uh, now sign next says, says we we have we we've been a month without crow jumping off the ship. <laughs> New high record. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, well, well, Ajax is off on the uh, the very the, the pointy bit. I'm on the close to towards the edge of it, just eating my meat. That. Oh god. <laughs> Eating my salted whatever it Pork. is. Pork. Pork, yes, Pork. thank you. Pork girl. Just sitting there just lazing about. Just chilling. Is it really like a not villain because Yeah. This nice is sort of thin cloud what, day. What time what time of day is it right Like barely after dawn. So like seven ish. Seven seven well, ish. <laughs> so so as like yeah. Carpenter starts getting down off the crow's nest and like off the mast he kind of takes a deep breath walks over to Ajax and just hands him a cup of coffee and then just says drink <laughs> and then goes over toward to button and, and like pulls off like half of his like thing of like uh, chop. chop his half of his pork chop pretty much and hands it to that hands it to Button and <laughs> just says, Make sure you eat this. You gotta keep your strength up. Here, here, she's okay. a self slip, whatever the fuck it is. We don't know what gender it is. Yeah, I'm just. Um, it's okay. It's a. Yeah. Button's button. Yeah, it's <laughs> button. <laughs> button. <laughs> button's button. <laughs> just, just all of a sudden you hear a. Oh, oh, thanks, mate! <laughs> and no, there won't be an Australian accent. I'm not fuck, fuck I'm not fuck with that. I'm not uh-uh. fucking with that. No. Well, as you, uh-uh. as you three get your morning started. You hear this god awful cacophony below decks. Ooh. And you realize Pi is awake. Pi I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna take a, a, a shot in the dark with some with some Nido Vision goggles here. I'm assuming this is probably gonna be our ship. <laughs> yes. Okay. Accents will be persistent throughout. <laughs> you hope. <laughs> Hopefully. We hope. Voices can sometimes. Yes. <laughs> we will try. We, we will try to do voices once we all get used to it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, Crow's easy because Crow's just a fucked up bullshit voice. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Right. Crow's Crow. Yeah. But he just got off the coffin and you just hear, hear from hear from below decks. Who the fuck got in my kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> and Parker starts walking down. <laughs> You just hear pots banging, shit being thrown Cats behind behind it behind no behind his clothes behind the closed door to the mess or maybe the mess. What the hell would it be called on a ship? I can't fucking remember. The mess hall. It would be the mess well, hall. It wouldn't be. It wouldn't be a mess hall. It'd just probably be like a mess room, a dime, a dime like or something. The slop drop. <laughs> the slop drop. The slop, slop drop. drop. No, okay. Official. No official. All right. Well, you walk into the room. <laughs> The I'm drop. assuming the drop. The drop. It's a drop going into the room. <laughs> well, we are going below deck. It's the lowest deck. If it's Friday night, you can expect Ajax to stumble. 
But you walk in, next thing you know, you got a freaking cleaver thud itself into the thud and bed itself in the wall beside you. I pull it out of the wall. Zero days without Zero. I just go, it was me, Pi. I got up before everyone, so I got. You know, you're not allowed in my damn kitchen. Every time I'm down in here, someone moves something, I can't fucking find it. I got two pork chops, I got a coffee, and I got some bird seed for crow. We were trying to hide that from him. <laughs> he won't eat much else. And I know last time I got yelled at for grabbing corn, so I took That's the- because that's my good corn. That's the shit I make to make him fucking quit drinking. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So that's why I took what I took. That's all. There ain't nothing moved other than what you moved. Well, then you can help me scrub this damn pot, then. <laughs> all right. He just lay, puts down the cleaver and just goes to... And it's not just the pot, it's the pot. The pot that he that he has cooked the shark surprise from last night in. There's a reason why we call it the slop drop. <laughs> I guess that's not the only thing that's to be dropping after all. <laughs> after, you eat, after you eat pie is cooking, we're very thin on this boat. It's, it's, it's very thin, so, except so, for pie, which is that which he, who is a portly motherfucker. So that's why we hired him. So I'm he going to a skinny chef. Exactly. damn skinny, so, unless they can eat like a fat man. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so what I'm I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start scrubbing. And I'm gonna do like a strength check to make sure I get in there, like <laughs> scrub ahead. it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the first roll. Of this. Fifteen. You're fine. Fifteen plus <laughs> three. <laughs> so like, as you just <laughs> as you, you're, you're, you're just scrubbing through it, and of course, Pi is going about his. He's like, you're gonna scrape off the Teflon. <laughs> Teflon. <laughs> oh, Teflon. <laughs> it's an iron pot. The seasoning. <laughs> There's a reason why there's mold in that pot. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> you heard me. <laughs> just, just out of nowhere. Hey, what? <laughs> As carpenters down below cleaning off the <laughs> last night's meal. <laughs> <laughs> if you can call it that. <laughs> you see your first mate come out of her room. And of course, she's in her typical straight, clean, fresh-pressed attire. And, of course, Helga is always Helga. Helga. Yes. Oh, I'm going to love this she, one. She, 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 she is her typical ex-military, prim, proper, holy fuck, I didn't know cloth could cut kind of person. <laughs> she w- <laughs> She walks out of her cabin, looks around, Stop. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just looks around and uh, observes the deck, and of course, only you and Button are are the, are the ones on deck, and of course, Crow is where Crow is supposed to be. Yeah. <laughs> it's like for for those of you who don't know who Crow is so far, Crow believes he's a bird, <laughs> literally a crow. That's why he's called Crow, and he has a tendency to just randomly leap. Off the ship. Don't we all? <laughs> At times, yes. Especially when... Dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Please, God, not another. He can't help it that he ha- that he he has to work with the shit that you guys catch. Uh, hmm. Well, that and every now and then the, the cloud barnacles he scrapes off the bottom of the ship. That's only after he cleans. <laughs> and that's Thursday that's night. <laughs> and you wonder why... You, you have these weird colored eggs on Saturday morning. <laughs> Shit. But she comes out, and of course, being her typical half orky self, just, just, just screams out, Attention on deck! And of course, no one fucking stands at attention. Ajax hey, kind of stumbles around, The fuck, what? <laughs> And, of course, and as she says that, she stands at, at the wheel and just freaking salute fucking the whole shit and caboodle. 
for Helga being Helga. And not two seconds after that, Captain Blue walks out. And I'm going to explain why he's called Captain Blue. His full name... <laughs> completely blocked on his first name. Bartholomew. Bar- yeah, thank you. Bartholomew Luther Eugene Esther is his full name. Dear Lord. But everyone shortens it to just Captain Blue. Yeah. Yeah, you get it now. <laughs> get yeah. it? Yeah. 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 No. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. And Captain Blue. Can Button stand to attention, but like, Yes, sir! Just hit myself in the fucking face. <laughs> Just a f- face plant. <laughs> yes! Man! <laughs> but Captain Blue walks up. And of course he's in his usual tricorn hat his big fucking bell boots trousers his his bandolier with his pistol and a sword his shirt though he isn't what he isn't what you would call a typical pilot because most typical pirates that most people used to are relatively human blue on the other hand I, I can't use a word because it's kind of covered under other things, but he is a cat person. That'll work. <laughs> and ironically, his fur is a Russian blue. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And okay. I am here to play you all. It was fun all the last I'll say it later. <laughs> And on his shoulders is his, is his pet that, all, that seems to be always with him. His pet, Crackers. Oh, God. Which is a pseudo-dragon. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Fucking a little, no. little freaking dragon-y, wyvern-looking thing. What color is he? Red. Fucking metal Red with little, with little black horns. Fucking metal, metal as hell. Metal and metal. his name is Crackers. Dude. Yeah. The most hardcore people you ever know. They're named like fucking Francis and like. Taserface. Taserface. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to cut that. Um, <laughs> probably, I don't know. It was slipping in. Anyways, um, yeah, pretty goddamn metal. Yeah, just fucking just do it. Dude, mm. just. just <laughs> <laughs> Captain Blue stands up, ne- and stands up next to Helga and just, just does the whole. Ah, I love the cloud air in the morning. Quick question, Mr. GM, DM, D, uh-huh. DGM, D, D, I have a feeling you're going to have a lot of questions. Um, is uh, Captain Blue, uh, Captain Blue in the face, uh, shorter than Helga? <laughs> yeah, by like a foot. Oh, God, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Blue yeah. is almost as tall as Button. And Button is a small, precious child. Not that small. Pretty small. Well, five, five, three. That's not small. That's small. Compared to the rest of us, where we're all like six Shut your foot. Mouth. <laughs> okay. My dude, six six, and just muscles. Captain Blue is is like five five. That's average. Not for well, for maybe maybe for him. <laughs> but next next to Helga, he's like a foot shorter. Helga's like six five. So like the difference between me and Nick? Basically. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> but he's got it, but he's got his hands on his hips, crackers around around his neck, and he's just smiling. What the fuck are you on about, ma'am? <laughs> it's a new dawn! We haven't crashed! How? I don't know. <laughs> I'll give you props there. <laughs> very true, very true. It's like Crow stole the ship, isn't he? Yeah. Crow! What? Yeah. <laughs> he says, as he can, he goes, good. <laughs> and he flips over the sign <laughs> the sign for another, for another day of Crow not fucking flying off the ship. <laughs> Full month! Woo! <laughs> it's like I knew those chains would hold. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> just like massive losing it. Yeah, it's just, yeah that's, that, that's what's holding him. Yeah. Well, Blue don't know that. Yeah. Blue, Blue don't Blue. know shit. But Captain doesn't know. Just, <laughs> just, 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 you know. <laughs> what he does know, drink sure as hell makes him forget. <laughs> Just, just talk like, to Ajax. He knows what his thing is. Is he like under the assumption that he runs everything, but he actually does like jack shit? shit exactly. Because <laughs> the only person, like, the only person that runs this ship is Helga. Oh yeah. That's why she is in a position she is. Because yeah. Captain is a typical. I I fly on a boat for the sheer fucking joy mm-hmm. of, the, of the open sky and randomly falling out of it. He does it to call himself a pirate, and that's about it. Yeah. That's about it. Hell, because the other one that only wants to get shit done. Alright. Now, there are two other crew members which really haven't been named. Okay. So they're just blank, so I'm just going to say they come up on deck, they do what they do, which is help, help with the rigging and all that kind of bullshit. Okay. And eventually you hear a ting, 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 and Pi go, it's fucking ready. <laughs> and on the other side of the ship, what's fucking ready? The eggs. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God, no. I used the rum this time. <laughs> okay, here I come. <laughs> Ajax, first one in, stumbles over the drop. <laughs> Perfect landing, 10 out of 10. Wait, damn, do I have to check that? No, I'm not, no, I'm not. <laughs> You're Jesus. not that drunk yet. Dude, I'm sober. I'm not the fuck you talking about. Face first in the eggs. I, I would <laughs> like, <laughs> I would like to, from 30 feet away. Yeah. I would like to put, point out mm. a carpenter is still scrubbing the pot. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're still fucking there. <laughs> yeah. Dude, you're going to be there until fucking noon. <laughs> Even with that strange shit? It's t- it was shark surprise. <laughs> It was 18. <laughs> that was shark surprise. About a foot of the pot. There's a reason why you use it for spare ammo. <laughs> oh. oh. The pot's got, we'll just say the pot's about a foot and a half tall from bottom to top. Yeah. Only about a foot of it's available yeah. right now. <laughs> We've got a problem with ulcers on board, so we just use it to kind of seal up. <laughs> <laughs> it's the kind of shit that sticks to your ribs. Literally. For uh, reason, I'm still holding up. <laughs> <laughs> the buttons, oh that's God. a sweet little child. <laughs> so innocent, so pure. <laughs> so innocent, so pure. Well, you all sit down. And of course, the, ca- the captain... Does his does does his morning talk? Pass talk. <laughs> well, speech, more speech, like. Speech, speech, speech. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I'm saying that's fucking canon. That's <laughs> speech, 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 speech. Hopefully, unless we crash today for whatever reason. Jinx. Crow. <laughs> we should reach port by. Hell, what time did you say we should reach it? Noon, sir. <laughs> Ooh, not not only is she clean cut, she's cold. <laughs> I like. <laughs> she's not Helga. She isn't. <laughs> True. She's like, I right, should reach it by. N- <laughs> it's just that face you made. It's like, what the fuck? We should reach it by noon. Which means the second we get in port is the second you lot hop off. Go find, go find us some work so that way we can repair this ship so it don't fall out of the sky. Where are we going? I fucking forgot the name. <laughs> 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 Why is it when I have nose? That's the one thing I fucking forget to write down. I have, I have like, what? One, two... He's got like fucking 30 pages of notes. He's got a notebook dedicated to Dedicated to this. And I, the one thing I don't fucking write is the damn name. <laughs> Here. So you know what? Actually, you know what? I'm going to toss this up to our listeners. Name this port. Because this will be a port that the group will be using rather regularly. So for right now, I'm just going to call it home. I'm just going to call it home. That'll work. But our listeners can name it. The most liked one. She'll. That'll get her done. 
Shield of the I would like to point out one thing. Mm. Carpenter's not eating, he's still scrubbing the pot. <laughs> Just, uh, I'm an inch through, come on. <laughs> I'm sure you could probably scrape something in, out of the pot and go, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> Carpenter has enough sense. <laughs> come on, come on. There's, there's, there's a reason why Carpenter... We're desperate, not stupid. <laughs> there's a reason why Carpenter somehow vanishes on Shark Tuesdays. <laughs> or Shark Mondays. I, I know what it's put in there. I've had to scrape it out before. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Ignorance is bliss, guys. We're fine. I eat wood. Don't. <laughs> yeah, just, just, <laughs> no protein. <laughs> protein. <laughs> fiber. <laughs> there ain't no fiber in that shit. True. Okay. Mm. I just said, I feel like it's all fiber. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, not just all That's fiber. That's Taco Every Tuesday, fiber. isn't it? Yeah. No, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> no, fiber is the shit that stays together. So is lard. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm imagining, like, you know, like... Hamster cages have the little, like the wood chippings. Yeah. Mm. That's that shit's fibrous. Okay? <laughs> yeah, that shit's fibrous. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. All right. The. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I fucking like it. I don't care. Yeah. I eat wood chips. <laughs> Fuck it. I, I just probably all you guys can afford. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody else has cornflakes. I have wood chips. I have wood chips. <laughs> With. Milk? Question mark. <laughs> milk? Yeah, we'll call it that for now. Self note, ask Pi what the milk is. You don't want to know. Cross that out. Don't ask Pi don't what, ask the, milk what the milk is. Don't ask Pi what the milk is. Just guarantee you, anytime you, Pi makes something new, don't ask where it came from. Don't look at what he has in the kitchen. Just eat it. Close your eyes. <laughs> plug your nose. And just as fast as you can go. Just just <laughs> down it. Down it as fast as you can go. Especially when it moves. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> there have been weird things coming out of pots lately. Pots? Pots. I'm getting Tribals. Little, like, like, chills. <laughs> like when you eat something gross and you get, like, I'll get that weird Or something certain... still alive. Hashtag at crickets. I know yeah, how to use Twitter, I swear to God. <laughs> Well, Captain does does his thing. He goes like, "All right, you three points at Carpenter, Ajax, and Button. Goes the second we hit port, is the second she goes and tries to find something because for whatever reason they like her." Okay. <laughs> Who wouldn't? <it>? True. <laughs> <laughs> very, very, very. Even the drunkard likes her. <laughs> <laughs> He point, he point, it points it points at he points at Carpenter and Ajax specifically and goes, "You two, go to the message board. You know where it's at. It's always in the fucking place unless for whatever reason someone destroyed it again for the third time this week. And see what's on there, and see if you can't find us a job. Button, go and find us some supplies. I I can do that. Hell, go. What are we low on?" Well, we have plenty of food. Plenty of drinks if Ajax hasn't used it yet. Um, are, we talk- the stash. are we talking about Tuesday stash or Wednesday stash? <laughs> We're talking about Wednesdays. Because that's God. Well, we might as well pick us some extra rum then, too. I hit that shit up Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at Tuesdays either. <laughs> There's a reason why I want us to be a dry ship. <laughs> Alright, what do we need? Well, we need some more citrus. For obvious reasons. <laughs> and cocktails. <laughs> <laughs> you just use you, you your pie go, we ain't need no damn citrus. I got your three food groups. Lard, bacon, and lard. <laughs> Relatable. Right. Uh, I'm a fan of bacon when I know where the fuck it comes from, Pi. <laughs> As Carpenter pulls out a hunk of lard, that's about a three inch. <laughs> that's three inches by itself. <laughs> See, you're wasting Pi, it. Pi goes over, he's like, I can use that. <laughs> <laughs> Just picks it up out of the fucking trash. He's like, 
He's got like a jar of lard, like you know how you have a jar of like used candle wax and shit like that. Yeah. He just puts it in. <laughs> just, pff, I'm gonna let that what marinate. Are you doing? I can use this. <laughs> He's just like, don't worry. You little key, big key. This is why I eat much. I'm fucking much. It's probably the best tasting stuff you've gotten. Can I try that next Tuesday? <laughs> I got you, man. Thank you. But Helga goes, so we need citrus. We need more rum, obviously. Sorry. Mm-hmm. Love you. And we need some more life preservers. Crow kind of wasted our supply. And if we can get enough money, we can actually BUY more! A uh, quick side note, uh, me and Helga are not a thing. You, just, yeah, don't worry. I'm just... This is the drunkard speaking, don't worry. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. I'm gonna tap that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tap it. Crit fail, never mind. <laughs> she taps me. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. You, don't, you don't know what hell goes on to. <laughs> and then from from the kitchen you hear, can you pick up some lumber? <laughs> Add that to the list. Thank you. Did you get rum? Make sure you add rum. Oh, and we, need, and we need some more fuel shards. I don't want to Fuel shards. Fuel shards? Fuel shards. Fuel shards? Fuel. F U L fuck F U E L <laughs> full shards full shards full shards ahead toot toot goddamn I'm fucking dead we need more food sharks <laughs> food sharks pies pies like, pie, we need more pies food like actually <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus okay is that all we need that should be all we need down real food. Please, for the love of God, we'll make it when pie isn't looking. <laughs> Please. You guys, you guys know where to find my stairs. <laughs> There's a reason why I keep the almond cookies in the top shelf. <laughs> <laughs> I like macadamia nut, personally. Mm, white chocolate macadamia. Yes. Oh, bitch. Get that nutty yes. goodness. <laughs> the sweet nutty goodness. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Before this turns into innuendo fest. <laughs> Isn't that us all the time? Hey, now. Alright. The ship, eventually, after the whole captain spiel, Helga lists off what your, all your duties are of the day. They're usually the same, because they don't fucking change. Ajax, don't drink too much. <laughs> Ajax, don't fall off the ship. Yeah. Crow, stay on the ship. It happened last time Crow went off. Ajax, if you can pee about this much without it being blood, it's been a good day. It's been a good day. <laughs> Your liver will thank you. What liver? <laughs> yeah, we still didn't get that robotic one put in there, did we? No, no we didn't. No we didn't. <laughs> Expansive, dude, shit. It's made out of wood, too. <laughs> <laughs> no, Carpenter carved him a liver. <laughs> Relatable. It's got it's charcoal little, on the inside of it. It's a little hey, crunchy. Hey, uh, uh, uh. No, Carpenter hey, just hits up pie. He's like, "Hey, uh, can I get like a spare liver?" He's like, "No, that's food." <laughs> that's food. <laughs> 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 uh, 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 if Carpenter made him a wooden liver, <laughs> that that would be like the like mahogany like. <laughs> That would be like the best <laughs> liver ever. It's some great A like imported mahogany shit. It's like shit. stained and everything. Like, it's never gonna see the light of day, hopefully. But <laughs> if it does, it, they're gonna be like, that, that's, a, that's pretty <laughs> nice. And that's enough time for, for some to reason. I, the fuck? For some reason, I'm getting the, the 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 feeling that the wooden liver is gonna become canon in this one. <laughs> The wooden liver 20k17. <laughs> the wooden 20K. liver 20k. Whoa. <laughs> the legacy will live on. <laughs> Woo. Eventually, your ship starts getting, it start, starts reaching home. I thought you were about to say lowering. I was about to say, is it natural <laughs> or? No, it's like as you're all up on deck doing your normal duties, captain's at the helm, crow's fucking being crow. Helga's standing at attention, doing what, make sure all y'all are doing what you're supposed to be doing. What am I supposed to be doing? You? Mm -hmm. Observing. 
I would assume. I can do that. <laughs> you are the ship's therapist. <laughs> well, yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're the most sane one out of all mixed by Helga. And even then, she has flashbacks. <laughs> <laughs> There's been an odd night where you just hear a... <laughs> <laughs> and Ajax is just... I don't know. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> Bad times, man. Bad times. It's I just want him like I brought you some tea. <laughs> Please don't kill him. Don't be the shit. The shit. <laughs> You're getting into. I am the glue that keeps it together. <laughs> You're getting into your home port. Why do you think my name is Buttons? <laughs> the clouds part, and there it is. A holy light shines down. No, no holy light. No, no, no. no. <laughs> you wish. <laughs> Home port, and like as I said, this is up to you all, you all listening, for coming up with coming up with this name, because I will leave it up to you. Is sort of a. Can we just canonically not know the name? <laughs> we just go there all the time. <laughs> as a clouds part, home is kind of a ramshackle port. What you would consider. Sort of not a shanty town, but a hastily built, or in this case rebuilt, more than once <laughs> town with various docks hanging hanging off in, in into the sky. Mm-hmm. Your ship gently, for once, <laughs> floats in and barely bumps. The, 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 side, the side of the Sky Island. And Ajax falls over. <laughs> and you see the dock master go, Aye! It's the Sliff! How are you doing, Button? I'm good! <laughs> What's up? <laughs> I'm doing good. Just making sure you don't crash for a change. <laughs> I know, it was like so smooth today. It was like chill. I can just keep a picture in my head. Fucking hippie. <laughs> when it comes to button. Which is probably not wrong. Yeah. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah. But of course the the, the, the dockman or dockmaster, portmaster, how Ever you want to call <laughs> He's the dock master. He's seen a lot of docking in his day. Oh my god. A lot, a lot of wood pass through these ports. Just, yeah. just go. Just stop. stop. <laughs> Let's get off this and get back on track. Ooh, get off. <laughs> I'm also ashamed of myself. <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> okay. Alright. So this, this the home Sky Island is your 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 typical is pretty much your typical island. It's of pretty medium size compared compared to most. Enough for a decently sized town to to have. Think of like an old sort of port town back back when America was being colonized for the first times and all yeah. that kind of shit. All that kind of shit that's been put up quickly that can survive. The Great Hopefully. Flood. Is that why they had to rebuild it? Uh, no, that's not why they had to rebuild it. No, the reason why they, yeah, the reason why they had to rebuild it is because while well, you're in the sky, wind has a tendency to be stronger. So shit blows over. A lot. Let's face it. Just flowing all down. You're not that heavy, rum drinker. So he's that heavy. There's a reason why you have a rum tank on the boat. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> no. <laughs> they they don't drive cars. They drive kites. No, not no, no yeah. hang gliders. That would be sick. Though. Yeah. yeah. Well, there are there are wingsuits, but they're not hang gliders. Okay. Anyway. Moving on. Sorry. <laughs> no, fine. You're fine. Go, go. Bitch, you're fine. Uh, we go. All right. Now, your dock and everything. The captain throw uh, has one of the, one of the random crew members. Tie off the boat and all that kind of shit. And he goes, You remember what I told you three to do? What? What, Carpenter? Uh, I'm still scrubbing the part. Uh, I'm, <laughs> still, I'm, I'm not leaving till that thing's clean. Clean. Okay. You're good. It's yeah. noon. 
It's new. Oh, okay. Silly? Sweet. <laughs> so, silly burn. I, I, I remember, I'm like... It's as clean as Pyle let you get it. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, he needs a seasoning, man. Yeah. So I go, yes, Captain. Uh, mesh this board. See what we can do. Yep. And I go off to back to my cabin to get... Get, your, get yourself. Yeah. So you are you going to head directly to the supply office button? Yes. Yes? Yes. Yes. All right. Uh, Ajax heads back to his uh, little spot to uh, go put on his shoes because uh, he likes to let the uh, the beasts that he calls his feet fly free. <laughs> the boats themselves. Yes. <laughs> so, so I kind of want to like describe what Carpenter looks like a bit. Go ahead. As he's changing, because like when he's on the ship, he usually wears like a ratty tank top and like just cargo shorts. <laughs> like <laughs> you mean britches. What? You mean britches? Shorts with a lot of pockets. And okay. I mean a lot of pockets. Too many. Too, too, probably too many. Enough to rival, like, true on nowadays cargo shorts. Yes. Yes. Because he carries stuff in it that he ha, needs. Ha ha, cargo shorts. Yes. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. But, um. Woo! <laughs> um, Carpenter is six foot six. Muscle. I mean, he is built that you could shred diamond on his ass. <laughs> like, oh, he is a carpenter, so he's used to lifting up the heavy, yes. heavy logs. He he has heavy bits of wood. He has uh, oh my. he has tat uh, a tattoo of the Roman numeral thirteen on his right arm and some other ones on his chest and back. Um, he he has scars all over him. His hair is like in the middle is black but all around the edge is all white like snow like pure snow white he's a skunk <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. he's a reverse skunk dun, dun, dun. Dun. and um Turns so out he always smells good <laughs> and like so he puts on like just good. these like like good sandalwood like yeah. he puts <laughs> puts on his boots he puts on his like Bridges. actual <laughs> pants it puts on like his Trousers. Work tank top. And, <laughs> yeah, yeah. His his work bro tank. Yeah. <laughs> and, and then he puts on his big uh, armored like trench coat, pretty much. And he picks up his case and starts walking out of the going to walk out of the ship. So you look like a typical sailor. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no. I look like something from Final Fantasy. <laughs> on, on roids. Plus your sword not included. Yes. <laughs> well, <laughs> well alright. If, if if we're gonna go ahead and do like quick character descriptions, Ajax, he's he's pretty clean cut. I mean, he's he's not fat, but he he's he's not the biggest guy. He's kinda of, he's he's got muscle to him, but he's a smaller Ajax guy. Ajax is what you would typically call normal. Yeah. I I'm more of a normal build kinda of like, oh yeah, he so did you're hard work. Shorter in the game than in real life? I'm 6'2 in the game. I am actually 6'4. I so gave myself a two inch handicap. You're welcome. <laughs> That's all you get. Uh, <laughs> anyways. <laughs> <laughs> um, he, Was that a dick joke? <laughs> he's kind of like the. He's like the spitting image of a stereotypical kind of like pirate, but on the boat, anytime on the boat. Even if he's getting off of the, getting off of like another boat onto his boat, the shoes come off in like one fluid motion. It's just like if my feet aren't touching the wood of the ship I'm on, that belongs or belongs to somebody who I belong to's ship, and then the boots are off. No exception. So he's just walking on. I'm the walking. Glass. No, no, he puts his boots on when. He... Hops off the ship. Oh, once I'm okay, off the ship, yeah. the boots are on. Once I'm on, on the ship, because that's, okay, that's, that's the only way he, that's the only way he can fucking balance. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But um, like big ass, dark brown, almost black leather riding boots, for reasons unbeknownst to him. But like, just it was the first thing he could afford. Just kind of very dark colors, and um. We'll, we'll go ahead and start with some of the more body features, because life and stuff, uh, or something, I don't fucking know. Anyways, uh, black hair all around, kind of larger, poofier, kind of, um, aliens. 
not not necessarily <laughs> aliens level, more spikes <laughs> straight up and less curly. <laughs> just kind of, if you could only see a hair in a crowd, you could pick them out. Um, you dark. See, you, see, you, see, you see like a shark fin going across yeah. the crowd. <laughs> yeah, more or less. Um, dark, charcoal, black eyes, and like I said, he's 6'2", he's kind of clean cut built. But, uh, sorry, 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 he's, and like I said, average build. He's like, younger, middle age, wait, hold on, how does that work? That doesn't work. He's like 25, fuck it. No. I'm really middle age, close. Like, yeah. Adult. 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 Of course, Button is... So, how's Button dressing for the day? <laughs> um, I don't know. <laughs> She's the only one with a wardrobe. <laughs> Everybody else is like, we've got two sets of clothes. One for one, work, one for play. One for today, the one that we're washing for tomorrow. Yeah, relatable. <laughs> button so, uh, Button is going to be... What, 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 what does Button look like? What does Button look like? Pretty, pretty standard. Um, you know, like the the like white shirt with like the. the so like, what you you going to go for like the the typical buccaneer sort of? Yeah. Uh, Buck swashler, thank you yeah. very much. Poofy sleeves. Yeah. Yes, poofy sleeves. <laughs> <laughs> Don't knock them. I love bum sleeves. <laughs> so. I've got like fucking leather pants, but not the skin tight ones, like the. But there's no fun in that. God damn it! No. <laughs> Her character was big. No. I'm not talking that concept. No. Uh. <laughs> You're gonna learn a lot about us, kids. <laughs> God. God. No. Um. Yeah. I got leather pants. I got some pretty standard shoes. Um, some working boots. I feel like a corset would be standard, but I'm not wearing one. You know, that wouldn't necessarily be considered standard. Or, I know, but like that's yeah. yeah. With what she would do, yeah, yeah. She, yeah. She's the information person. That would be the be topic. more professionally, yeah, yeah. <laughs> more well dressed for yeah. this shamble the crew. Yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> so you take your I'm your. I'm pretty comfortably dressed. Okay, so you're so you kind of take after Helga, but not so I can cut shit with cloth kind of person. <laughs> I yes. am officially deemed Helga as Captain Cotton Cutter. Captain Cotton Cutter. <laughs> Captain Cotton Cutter. She could take her shirt she's sleeve not a and captain. cut you in half. She's not a captain. Exactly. Though. That's why she's Captain Cotton Cutter. <laughs> better not say it to her face. Fuck no, dude. I don't want to die. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, triple C? Yeah. She's triple C. <laughs> it's not a rum. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> 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 Only for special nights. Anyway, <laughs> Only for special nights. Go, 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 go. Alright, so... Carpenter and Ajax have their job to do. I'm assuming that Button's gonna be going and doing what she's supposed to be doing, which yes. is go to the supply office. Yes. I'm hightailing it as far as my tiny legs will take. <laughs> is the message board on the way to wherever she's going? Mm-hmm. Okay. Because the, the, the message board is basically smack dab in the middle of the town. It's where everyone who needs something done, wants something done, is looking for something, has, has something to announce. They put it on the message board. Okay. So I, I want to walk with Button as far as I can, okay. just to make sure. See, you're get... walking, but I'm running. <laughs> Power walking. <laughs> It's my fucking Car- life, okay? Hanging out. I'm hanging out with you guys. Like, every step you guys take, I have to do, like, two steps. Like, real awkward. <laughs> just, 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 or, like, one really <laughs> awkward, like, long <laughs> step. Like, I'm doing lunges. <laughs> Low yeah. key. Carpenter like, just kind of tries to slow down. Just... Hey, Jax is just trying to stumble through the fucking <laughs> crowd. Just like, oh, sorry. So- sorry. 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 <laughs> Oh, hi! Hey, come over to the... Fuck. <laughs> and you just hear from the distance, Ajax, no. But... No. Fine. <laughs> Parked over there. <laughs> Parked over there. <laughs> anyway. So, do you walk as far as you can till she basically turns into the supply office? Yeah. So, do you want to go first? 
Bree for yes. Button. Yes. All right. You walk into the supply office. You see the usual face of Eustace. Uh, yes. <laughs> of Eustace standing there. Him and him and his wire glasses. White, wild ass hair. Mm-hmm. Sitting behind, sit, sitting behind the counter desk thing, kind of a combination of the two, mm-hmm. writing in his ledger. Mm-hmm. He looks up and goes, "It's Button." He's like, "I haven't yeah. seen you in a week." Yeah. 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 So, what brings you here to my humble shop? I'm. I need some shit. <laughs> The usual, or has Helga modified it again? I don't know. We need we need some more rum than usual because. Well, that's usual because that's that's Ajax. <laughs> I could retire <laughs> off <of> him. Okay. <laughs> I have a reputation. <laughs> yeah, pretty, yeah, pretty standard, I guess. Then. All right. Let, do you have Do you have it with you? Let me see. He takes it and whatnot and starts reading it and goes, I think I might have some of this. Though the citrus might be a problem. What? Why? <laughs> well, the supply ship that usually be out here by now hasn't came through. When's it, when's it supposed to get here? Well, it was supposed to be here this morning, but for some reason it just isn't. Could it have just... In the weather? Uh, it's been clear the last couple of days. I don't see. I need my oranges. <laughs> well, scurvy can ha- go half the weight. Do you, do you have any like, leftover tubes? <laughs> no. Are you sure? Completely. If this doesn't, Shit. if this doesn't tell you what Helga's like, then I don't know what will. Just like any, any fucking anything. Lemon? I will, t- I will, I will take, take the dried up lemon slice that you had in your cocktail last night. Please, anything. <laughs> I don't want to die tonight. I will take the fucking pomander you made. The fucking dried orange full of clove, cloves. Give it to me. No, he doesn't I have it. anything. <laughs> I need it. I need it. Oh, shit. I need it. I'm sorry, I just don't have any citrus. Oh, shit. Where can I get any? Well, I mean, you could head to the island where it's made. Well, grown. Then made. <laughs> How far away is that? Uh, about two days trip. But by by your ship now. or ours? <laughs> well, it depends on whether or not Crow crashes you again. It might be three. I'm gonna get rained. Don't bring my Well, that is Helga after all. <laughs> oh, yeah, by the way, I have a special order for her. Takes out the drawer, puts this really nice looking case. Up on up on up on top top of the desk, it's got like, like a little brass lock on it. Mm-hmm. He goes, "She has the key. Don't break into it. Don't do anything to it because you know her. The second someone touches her mail, can, I don't want to be you if that happens." <laughs> can can I know what's in it? I don't even know what's in it. Where'd you get it from? <laughs> it was delivered. From where? I don't know. It came off the mail boat. <laughs> Mail it. What kind of supply office is this? <laughs> Paid to see Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know how it got here. We don't know where we got it from. We just have it, okay? <laughs> Some questionable okay. items. Our supply here. office, post office. I just fucking work here. <laughs> I, I'm the middleman. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, well, shit. Okay. I think I can just get back on the boat and bat my eyelashes and be, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, you are you. You might be able to get away with it. <laughs> but he, he kind of tilt, tilts back, looks around, makes sure there's no one else in the office. Pulls something off of else from, the bo- from the bottom of the his yeah. desk, his yeah. shelf, cabinet, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Yeah. Puts a little pouch in front of you and goes, this might make her... A little less 
her. Okay. Pops it open. It's got these huge, thick tobacco leaves inside of it. Mm. Like, like the kind of shit you can roll. My yeah. kind of girl. <laughs> yep. Okay. And he goes, just give these to her. Smooth it over. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Do you think... Do you think anybody in town has, like, a surplus of, like, oranges or orange cousins? You can try the cantina, but I wouldn't want to make I'd make sure Ajax doesn't get in there first. Too late. <laughs> Off in the distance. Too late. You and your fucking girly drinks. No. They're not girly unless you say they are. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, I'm all for that. <laughs> Girly drinks are, like, fantastic. They're fucking delicious. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, you package up Helga's package. The w- the planks of wood. Some cases of rum. Am I carrying all this? You've got, like, you've got, like a wheelbarrow track thingy that you can push. Okay. Okay. Plus, you've got freaking carpenter whenever, whenever you need him. He's a workhorse. <laughs> He is the Clydesdale of humans. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Clydesdale. Omelids. Special bread. <laughs> Quote unquote. <laughs> this is like the semi truck of horses. <laughs> so you package up all your stuff and whatnot. And you start heading back. So we'll move on to Carpenter and Ajax. So you guys get to the message board. Do you see what's there? Yeah. <laughs> no. You're there. I I, we saw it was there. We're good, right? <laughs> yeah, we're good. I put a little I just... citrus wanted. <laughs> yeah. You're nowhere near there yet. Okay. You're going the opposite direction. You're taking it away. Also, oh, you're not, shit. Also, you're not even out yet, technically. <laughs> technically. technically. Well, anyways. anyways. All right, you see normal sort of... This week is hap- This week's events happening and all that kind of shit. The typical small town yeah. crier. The, this is the news. Johnny's been drinking again. That kind of shit. <laughs> Paula's cat had kittens. <laughs> They're just as fucking obnoxious. <laughs> but speaking of cats, one of the posters for the help wanted section is a poster for a missing cat. It's in the handwriting of a little girl, pretty much. Of a little kid, you can't really tell it's a girl. Oh god! Of a, of a little kid about t- uh, saying that her cat's been missing for two weeks. Oh shit! Oh she god! Get me back to me. Another poster is sort of made from this weird shiny paper kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. It, it says "Lost Foci will pay if found." Doesn't give an amount. Okay. Doesn't give it foci. Like the points on the ellipses. No. <laughs> Soon to be explained. A foci is basically... Ladies, ladies and gentlemen, that was a math joke. <laughs> a foci is an item used by magic users to help focus their magic better. Okay. Because magic here, if... Magic here is... It's instructions for shaping the energy of the universe. Okay. If you don't shape it properly, you can fuck up... So- like, bad. Like, bad, bad. Okay. Folk eyes help to prevent this from ha- from occurring. And apparently it seems like a mage might have lost theirs. And another one is, says, escorts for, mer- for merchant ship. And it has the gold value on it. How many golds? 10,000 gold. That's, that's a lot. That, that is right back down. I can't see the paper in front of me. Fuck, I'm still drunk. (laughs) (laughs) J.K. Lowell. And then under that poster, it says, Mercenaries needed for town guarding. Okay. And it's for an island not too far away, about three days trip. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Nudge, 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 wink, nudge. Exactly. Huh? <laughs> I like that just flew over your head. We'll get to it. Okay. So 
Sorry, we're just writing stuff down. It's okay. Don't it's worry. Okay. We're, we're totally not well, filling time. So, um, a- Ajax finally setting, finally blurry vision clearing from the three hour morning. Well, the three hours that it has been his morning. Sees the, uh, the, the missing cat poster. And, um, his cold, dead, black, frozen over, barely even their heart. Just slightly, just thaws a little bit. Just enough for a couple little drops of water to come off of it. And just, but, a little drop. And I'm like, oh, that poor kid. That cat's probably been eaten by now. <laughs> I mean, I'm still going to look for it, but shit. <laughs> that kid. Fuck. Well, on the poster for the missing cat, it gives a location of where this child's house is. <laughs> um, is there Small any town. is there any description of the cat? Yes. They're so perfect. Damn it, because I wanted to go see the kid. <laughs> the description is has on her for quotes patches. Ca- uh, white calico. Oh. With orange and black patches oh. and a crooked ear. Oh. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fuck. What a fucking cat. <laughs> is this the type of message board that what's there you take? No. Oh. Do, uh, uh. Shit was expensive fuck. back then. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well. That, you're not the only one looking for bounties, so. Yeah. Well, I didn't know if it was, like, one of the ones that, oh, I can do this. It's mine. Fuck Yeah. No, um, this, this is like missing cat general kid going, I want my kitty back. Yeah. I turn, and I, I, I've i wrote all this down and stuff, and I go, I tell I Ajax. Right Alright, these are the jobs we can do. Let's go talk to the captain and... Captain Blue Balls? Yeah. Captain Blue, <laughs> and see what we can, what we should do. Don't start that shit. <laughs> We're not calling them blue balls. You guys might not be. <laughs> but when I get slammed, we'll have a good time. Anyways. Okay. So, um. So you guys. I feel like you're gonna get really drunk and be like, hell girl, you're making me get <laughs> I want you to want me like a new pressing iron. <laughs> I don't fucking know. What the hell was that? I don't know. Alright. So, I'm assuming you guys are heading back to the captain to go, this is the shit we can well, do. Slowly but surely. How, how, how far with that? You'll get there when she's there. I mean, oh, I was going to say, has she walked out? And yeah, stuff she's already fucking gone. Oh, well, I was going to say, if we ran into her, I want to, and if she would You guys like, pretty oh. much hit the boat at the same time. Okay. Right, cool. You quit playing with the jello. Fun fact, everyone, we have Jello. It's pretty lit. Anyway, um, but uh, you don't look at me like that. Even your Jello. <laughs> okay. Leave me alone. I can't have one since this Okay. So, um, I mean, it, she's she's not wrong. Anyways, so we 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 get to the ship. Ye? Yes. Okay. You see Button pushing her basically a wheelbarrow of uh, junk. Okay, and right on top of it, you see the bottles of rum. Uh, <laughs> just a- Ajax becomes like a kid who sees a toy on the top shelf. Gimme. Get you I immediately you immediately see you, see you immediately see Helga go. <laughs> I even like no. suddenly I grab, stops. I grab him by the back of the shirt. No, I don't want to. That rum this. is going into storage. Mm. Why'd you tell him where it would storage be? Storage in my belly. <laughs> well, there's a reason why I keep the key on myself rather than giving it to the captain because he's almost just as bad. What? I have a toolkit for that. <laughs> <laughs> You're not coordinated enough to hold a pencil, let alone like a lockpick. I didn't have anything to write on. And he's not drunk. Yet. <laughs> I, I get more sober the more drunk I get. Trust me. 
Yeah. He's, he's a very functional sense. drunk. Huh? He's a very functional drunk. Yeah, I know people who only act like real people after they, like, smoke weed. Yeah. You know? The guy. Remember, kids, if drugs aren't legal in your place, don't do them. Yes. As we were. Yeah. So... You get back on the ship, and you see, and Helga snaps her fingers at you, going, no, battle, no, bad Ajax. I freeze, because, holy shit, Captain, Captain Cutter. She comes down from her perch up top, ne- uh, next to the captain, and starts to inspect what you have. And she goes, where's the oranges? <laughs> Button. I'm dying! <laughs> Your mouth a jello. <laughs> Swallow. Stop. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> Eat the jello. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the shit didn't come in. Like you're supposed to be so supposed to come in a couple hours ago, but it didn't come in. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. He still doesn't give this to you. <laughs> Give what to me? This, this little pouch. It's for you. She takes it. Opens it. It smells really good. <laughs> she kind of buttons it up. Puts it into her pocket. <laughs> you know, was there anything else? <laughs> you, uh, this thing. This giant box thing. <laughs> oh, I finally came. So hard, I didn't and for it. once, you finally see her face smile. <laughs> Ajax goes, I'm not getting on the ship. She's fucking possessed. I'm not getting on the fucking ship. What, what, what's the box made out of? She's been possessed like by Navy Jones. You see polished to a shining gleam mahogany. For once, you see Carpenter. Hey, what you got there? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, like hey. he... Hey, bud. It is for my eyes only. It is not for any of you. I don't care what's in it. The uh, box. That's good craftsmanship. I mean... You're not the, getting my box. I don't want the box. I want to inspect it. That's good. That's <laughs> great craftsmanship. The, the lining's correct. The, the sealant's it. correct. I mean, even the how how they put the sealant. Oh, my gosh. She tucks the box behind her and goes, Carpenter, don't you even think about t- taking it apart. D- no, how <laughs> dare you? <laughs> I was about to say, Holga, I would give it to him, but he would cream himself. It's like he's a baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's like defiling the ship. You don't do that, no. You're not getting my box. And she walks to her cabin. <laughs> and of course, no, she knowing the entirety of the crew, you hear... Chunk. <laughs> and you just hear from Ajax. She's a Loki. The locks on her on her, on her side. <laughs> <laughs> and you just see Carpenter look at his arm, flex. <sighs> no. Don't try it, mate. <laughs> Don't try it. I've got. I've, I've been in that room before. Don't ask. I've got There's about an inch of iron. <laughs> She's locked harder than storage. All <laughs> <laughs> Hey. So now that you guys are back on the ship, you got uh, you two are gonna go talk to she wears Blue. More than one yes. kind of belt. Yeah. God damn it! So <laughs> no. So we, get, we go into like the captain's quarter thingy. Captain's. Yeah. All right. He's sitting at his beautiful, awesome desk that you had actually carved. Did you know it? Dark wood, polished, polished to a gleam, only because Helga's the only one that polishes the damn thing. <laughs> Because you're not allowed in there. Because you're not allowed to get in there. <laughs> Blue's sitting behind behind his desk, fiddling around with his sextant. <laughs> the natural born sailor boy's like, dude, you're gonna fucking break out of Spartacola. <laughs> well, he's changing the settings on it. I know. I know that sextant. I know that model. Boy. <laughs> Boy. Past the third click, it's fragile for the next three. And he, he, he looks up and goes, Hey, you guys are finally back! Finally! Hey. We've only been gone for about a... Where's the sun? <laughs> An hour. Well, Carpenter, I can expect to come back. You, I usually have to bury out under underneath a keg barrel. I'm still sober, unfortunately. 
Well, what did you guys find at the message board? Well, we found four different jobs. One was for, like, mer- uh, mercs to guard a town. It's about three days trip. Um, some, I'm guessing, wizard lost a foci, and he's he didn't give an exact number, but it said we'll pay anything, so we might be able to... Well, get some money out of that. It said we'll pay, but we can assume it's gonna be a high price because that paper looked kind of pricey. It was shiny. <laughs> it was shiny. It, I mean, it was I mean, to be perfectly honest, that kind of makes you like a little bit top tier. Yeah. <laughs> That's Blue kind of kind of strokes his whiskers and goes shiny, shiny. <laughs> I and like then, shiny. Yeah, and like then shiny. there was a a it's missing cat Joe poster. We must help the cat. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> well, I was actually... Cat gonna, first, uh, coin later. <laughs> I was actually going to ask you, can we go help... It's yes. A, it's a little girl's cat. Yes. Okay. Cat, blue goes, just, just holds the hand and goes, look at me. I, I know, but... The goddamn cat. Find the cat or don't come back. It's just... <laughs> this needs to be between I too us like to be three in here. Helga can't find out. Why? We're wasting time trying to find a cat. I've got her, don't worry. Okay. Uh, no, <laughs> I've got her. Also, she has a really nice box. <laughs> <laughs> We've all seen her on laundry day, but you don't need to mention her. No, no, no. Um, Button brought... A box of something on and the craftsmanship. Oh, of it. she finally got it. Oh. I don't care whatever's in it, whatever's in it. I just, if you can get me that box, <laughs> she's not giving that up. I don't. I, I'll. I'll build her a new box. I'll build her a box that is better secured. I just want to. She's not giving it up. Trust me. Just want to study I know it. what's in it. She's not getting it up. I just want to study it. Dang it. Okay. Go fucking shit ass. <laughs> This is a reason why that box has a lock. It has one. <laughs> this one can get into it. Shut it's the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> it's Helga. All she needs needs is a, is a one lock on a box and a pistol at her belt. Yeah. That's for a sign shut up. She's probably listening. <laughs> oh, I can guarantee she's listening. <laughs> There's a soft thud on the wall. The, the, the. Just fucking panicking, like, don't mention me. I'm not here. Anyway. So, you guys decide to go do the lost kitten? Yeah. Alright. So, actually, as we walk out and stuff, I, I see Button unloading stuff, mm-hmm. and I go, hey, Button, um. Hey. I know most people don't like us well socially. Yeah. Because <laughs> drunk and yeah. big scary teddy bear. Oh, oh no, trust me. It's not the fact that I'm drunk. It's that I've been with just about him and his wife. <laughs> and I, I was wondering, there was a, a mission to find a missing cat. And it's a little girl's. And I wondered if you would come along and just be our interpreter. <laughs> Find a fucking cat. It's fucking dead. <laughs> oh, shit! Oh. <laughs> Remember, kids, don't let me talk to anyone sober. Um, as long as, long as certain people stay on the ship... Fucking... You know, I'm the one who can climb shit. Uh, I'll give you an extra barrel. Mm, you drive a hard bargain. I actually... <laughs> the barrel's like this big. It's like a mini keg. Yeah. We actually do need him. For what? I'm... He's a little bit of a more... He's finesse. I'm strength. F- finesse where? He might Give be, me a bottle he might be the one, one that has to climb the tree. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a bottle, I'll show you. I tr- Give me a boost. Me. Yes, I mean, you could do that, but three people searching, a lot less time. 
<laughs> well, when it's two people and him searching, it's about the same. I will repeat myself one more time. Myself. You're not that in didn't this feel conversation. Like good grammar. Well, fuck it. Here's the segue. I'm in it now, motherfucker. <laughs> Just give me one bottle, doesn't even have to be a fucking keg, just one goddamn bottle to get me a little less sober and I can fucking operate. Carpenter reads in his jacket, pulls out his flask with a bright red rose on it. Yes. Twists it. Give me a cup. You just hear this giant clatter as he runs, as Ajax runs into the fucking kitchen. Pie cup now! He's like, what? Cup? No! You don't need no cup. Pie. (laughs) And cup. Too late. (laughs) Runs away. And I I will. You just hear. (laughs) Something sharp and pointy hits a wall beside you, but you don't care. I don't give a fuck. Alcohol. Negative one babes. (laughs) (laughs) And I I, want to point out that two things. Carpenter stuff is very important to him. And sharing th- any alcohol that's in this flask means serious business. <laughs> it's like, we need to get shit yeah. done. So it's just like, okay. here, take it. It's a shot. Oh, that's a shot. <laughs> you behave. I'll give you some more of my secret sash. Just more? <laughs> <laughs> just more? Secret? <laughs> yes. How long have you aged this? Ajax starts nitpicking every single little fucking detail he can out of the alcohol. Just, it's, I'm getting like hints of nut. Just nice. Just little, drink the little, damn just, alcohol. I can tell what kind of wood is the better one. Hey guys, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> Fortitude save for me, Nick. Oh fucking seventeen. Hey, you're fine. Fuck off. <laughs> you're not drunk, Ajax. You're normal, Ajax. I'm functioning, Ajax. Thank you right. very much. So you go to the little girl's house. Yeah. It's typical cottage for this, for this village and all that kind of stuff. And I'm assuming you're going to knock on the door? Yes. Button. Button, button, button knocks on the door. door. Ajax just kind of laying, okay. sitting across on the house, just kind of... Doing his normal little, just like, watch every motherfucker with hands. <laughs> and the ones without especially. You hear the bolt go up, up being open from the inside of the door. Yes. And the figure standing in front of you is this wee little girl Aww. with pigtails Aww. and a bright blue blue dress. She got, she's got a little voice and goes, Hi, are you here to find my kitty? Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking lose it. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking lose it. <laughs> are you here to find my kitty? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> it's like, it's like, it's you're just losing. <laughs> Is the cuteness too cute? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, we're, yeah. We're gonna find the cat. Yay, someone's gonna help me find my kitty. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he just be, just Ajax is behind Bud and fucking losing it. Just like, oh my god. <laughs> and you hear this little girl goes, Mommy, people are here to help me find patches. <laughs> okay. She. <laughs> Mom, she is his, his woman walk out. Normal, sort of like everyday, sort of like mom. Ajax yeah. suddenly turns around. <laughs> and like, she kind of looks at all of you. <laughs> Eyes, Carpenter, kind of warily. Ajax, yeah. more. And looks at Button and goes, oh. Hi. <laughs> 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 just like, just don't let her see your face. <laughs> So she's like, so I'm, I'm, I'm guessing you saw my daughter's poster. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Project. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. 
And she's like, okay, well. Yes, I saw her poster and I felt so obligated. I needed to find her cat for her. Okay. I had to. I had to. All right, well, sweetie, you want to show them where you saw, where, where you last saw Patches? Yes, mommy, I want to show them where I saw Patches. And oh fuck, I don't like that. I don't like the look on your face. <laughs> what look? Um, th- this is where. Um, what's the uh, the the mom's name? Just for shits and giggles. Mary. Mary. Okay, continue on. Why do you want to know her name? Just, was? just keep going. Okay. She's like, okay. And they take you around to the back, back of the house. Mm-hmm. Out the back of this house is like the, almost the very edge, edge of the village. Mm-hmm. There's a forest that stretches for a pretty good distance oh, into, into the island. Like the island's not completely colonized, as it were, quote yeah. unquote colonized. And the little girl goes, I saw patches running there. <laughs> oh, dear Lord, you're cute. <laughs> just resisting the urge just to say your cat's dead so do you, do you have any bears in the woods sweetie <laughs> not that we know of but, um do you have anything of the cats any I have her bell can can we take that it might help track her yeah, it's her favorite toy all right. She hands you. She hands you like this brass bell. <laughs> so I, I take it. Putting in Ajax, just losing it again. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and I go, honey. Th- this huge of thing of a man just like kneels down from this girl. I will find you your cat. Yay! And, I, and she uh, hugs you. <laughs> <laughs> I, she goes up to like your knee. <laughs> I, I, I go, okay. And I put the bell in like one of my pockets on my coat and I turn to the, the, the mom and go, all right, um, do you usually let the cat out a lot? Is this normal for it? No. Usually she's back at night. All right. But she hasn't, she hasn't been back for two weeks now. All right. Um. Can I hold the bell? Neither <laughs> Hmm? Can I hold the bell? You know, he he yeah. has the bell currently. Yeah, Carpenter sure. Knows. What do Take those jingle, jingle, jingle. Huh. Do anything? No. no. I want to hold the bell. Okay. Give me the bell. You got the bell. Jingle, 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 jingle. jingle, jingle, jingle. <laughs> All right. So they tell you that the cat ran into the forest about two weeks ago. Has been back. Usually gets back at night. So I'm assuming you guys are going to tippy toe into the forest. Do we have any torches? Check your inventories. Yeah, I do. Yeah. You do? I yeah. At least I have. Plus, you guys remember it's daylight. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how long we're gonna be in there. Yeah. I don't know how thick the canopy of the forest is. Yeah. So yeah. Like, is there? You won't need torches for the. Is there any like tracks? Where like the cat would usually walk, how in in grass it usually makes. Yeah, there's you 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 can see like a a, a cat trail. Yeah, cat trail. Uh. So have we started walking yet? Yeah. yeah. Just kind of over the shoulder. Hi, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> Just kind of sprints ahead a little. Bit. <laughs> <laughs> Just like you're terrible. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Mary off in the back. Going, you fucking what? <laughs> this is probably your dog. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys start making it up the cat's trail. I'm scooping up the, scooping up the field mess, bopping them on the head. <laughs> but I need you all to make a perception check for me. First group roll, oh, kids. Oh, I got eyeballs. Yep. 16. 8. Without any modifiers, and mod is. That's three. You have modifiers. What's modifier for no. perception? Is it actually just perception? It's, it's is perception. Yeah, yeah, you should have it written down. Total bonus is six, so add six to roll. Yep. Wolf. Yeah. Okay. Twenty-two. So, yeah. Twenty-four. As you're walking. Seven. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> right. That's right. Like, there's so much wood here. <laughs> Pretty much. I. I'm, it's more like. 
I, I'm so focused on following the trail, I'm just like... <laughs> He's got <laughs> nose dug into the ground. As you, as you guys are walking around, both Bud and Ajax notice this shiny piece of metal off the side of the trail. Go towards the middle. Real quick. Mm. Um, just just for further background on the world in which we live in now. Uh-huh. Was there any, like, kind of, like, automatons or... Yes. Okay. Right. Next hand on Cutlass ready to go. Ajax, Well, sorry. you guys really don't know this. I mean... Your characters don't know this. True, 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 true. Because for the old world, not a lot of the records from back then exist. Uh, There's yeah. only one city that is a, an example of what the old world used to be. Mm-hmm. But it's dilapidated to the point where even the old world people will go, I don't want to fucking live there. Yeah. Oh, wait. So, well then. Don't be the shiny. Yeah, let's walk towards the shiny. All right. Hey, carp, 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 carp. Yes. <laughs> Metal. Metal. Uh, right. Do you notice they, when they point it out, they you notice it. Well, I guess you all go up to this piece of shiny metal. Mm-hmm. You pick it up. Who picks it up? Who wants to pick it up? Me. Oh, well. Oh. I guess Button's going to. But... <laughs> <laughs> it's a cat's collar. Oh, oh shit. Cat's... It's, it's, it's a leather band. With a metal nameplate. On the cat's collar is this leather strip with a metal nameplate on it that says Patches. Mm-hmm. Like someone paid a smith to make this uh, cat's for dead. this cat. Yeah, cat's dead. It was stuck in a bramble patch. Mm, cat's dead? You don't know if the cat's dead can, or not. Can I see the collar? Here you go. He starts like looking over like how it's made and stuff, looking for any like tears, like if it's been ripped off or. It looked like it was stretched and then snapped. Like the cat so, was just trying to get out of the brambles. Yeah. So maybe. Can I perception check? Go ahead. No, I'm gonna do that too. Nat 20. First nat 20. Yeah, 5 and 8. You see spots of dry blood leading from this bam- br- bamble. <laughs> leading from this bramble. <sighs> and the perception check for me. <laughs> nat fail. 17. Alright, you, right, you got it. 19. You see this trail kind of lead off into a cave. Um, well, this will be fun. And this is where we will leave it off for this for this week's episode. I'm glad we got porches. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. Uh, this is the first episode, and we're... we hope you enjoy. Thank yeah. you. And see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.